So if you guys get equipment from us, the way that you reach out within those first three months, if you have an issue, is through Tech Tickets. We, we put that system in place about two years ago. Helped us a ton. I think it helped the consumer a lot as well. If you're thinking about starting a pressure washing business, but you want to learn more about the equipment, mixing chemicals, how to clean every surface on a residential job site, property protection, and much, much more, check out the How to Wash course. It'll be the first link in the comment section and the description. Yo. Hey, you gotta be over here in the shop. What are you doing up here in the first place? I'm introducing you. Well, I, here I am. Well, I'm not editing now. I'm going to leave all that in there. So, <laughs> guys, the Southeast Soft Wash, obviously, you're on the channel. And this is a Richard. Now, if you guys don't know, Richard's got his own channel. Rusty Rooster, right? The Rusty Rooster. The Rusty Rooster. Uh, and this is something I wanted to do last year. We were really freaking busy last year. Yes, we were. I ain't had time to do a lot of this kind of scheduled content. But this year's a little bit better. We're going to try to do a little more scheduled content. So this is the first in our Maintenance Monday series. Now, I'm a tech, techie guy. Dusty's in there. He's a techie guy. But I wanted to get another personality on the channel because Richard, he does he does have a little bit of a personality. It's, there's a short joke right there. A little bit of a personality. <laughs> We're already starting off bad. But you do have a lot of knowledge. How long have you been in the pressure washing game fooling around with this stuff? Oh, 30 plus years longer than i've been alive or right yeah. at it yeah right at it i'm gonna be 36 this year so richard's got a ton of knowledge on engines we got a vanguard uh right there we got a v-twin right here we've got a ton of built up pressure washers smart blends smart streams i'm looking at belt drives and a whole bunch of gearboxes and pumps and all kinds of cool stuff right cool stuff that has to be put together so a lot of these videos we're going to just have an idea of something we want to talk to you guys about that's maintenance related this industry is heavy on maintenance. Um, a lot of corrosive kims, pressures, you know, belts, gearboxes. The good news is most of it's pretty simple, and that's what we hope to make this series is like a quick guide to help you out. But it is a lot of like I would say small maintenance. Yeah. Uh, nothing crazy. No. We're not setting time on a engine or anything no. like that. But we, we can. We can do that. Um, no. You you got more in here than we ever really need to apply out in the world of pressure washing. But we're also going to do a lot of content based on our favorite topic which is technical support tickets tech tickets so if you guys get equipment from us the way that you reach out within those first three months if you have an issue is through tech tickets we we put that system in place about two years ago helped us a ton i think it helped the consumer a lot as well but uh we do get some silly ones every once in a while and so we may have to black the names out and uh not do not to cause unjust harm to the guilty or the innocent but those tech tickets are going to be a source of, these are what people are running into in the field, yes. right? So we're going to try to, when we get a good one, we'll bring it to you guys and show you and then walk through what the issue was, whether it's a legit issue. So we do get those, uh, but a lot of them are kind of operator error kind of thing. So we want right. to make sure we address them as well. What else are we going to talk about? Is that it? Uh, we got a list over there. We got a list over there. We just show them the list. We got, uh, we're going to show you how to use a multimeter on some basic checks. Uh, we're going to rebuild a couple gearboxes. Uh, some of you may want to do that in the future. Uh, simple things, things you ought to know, things maybe your daddy should have showed you already. My daddy held, uh, made me hold a flashlight, and he said words to me that I can't repeat on the YouTube channel. We may um, use those words. So we may try to get you guys up to speed on some of that stuff. It's it's uh, what Richard calls man crap, but he don't say crap. So basic maintenance stuff. And it's, it's an endless amount of content for us. He likes his stuff anyway. So if you guys aren't following his channel, go jump over. Uh, Rusty Rooster, good stuff on there. Small engine stuff. That's right. You fool around with a lot of stuff on there. Chainsaws. We, we, we may even not do something that's in the shop. We might do something. May go on a field trip. That's right. All right. Well, that Maintenance Monday series, going to make a playlist so you guys refer back to this video as the introductory. Uh, but everything under here, we'll try to upload every Monday. If I don't upload every Monday, he gets to hit me with that. Uh, All drain too. Use the other end, please. Yeah. Hit me with the small. There we go. All right. <laughs> Hope you guys have a great week. We're fixing to go wash a house with a Gen 2 skid. We'll see you later.